How's it going guys? So we got one of the last weeks here of training with Brooke, probably about one or two more episodes. So this was actually Tuesday, just got some bench press footage here. We went to kind of an upper body day on Tuesday because she was having some issues with her, her lower back after her deadlifts Monday, her deadlifts and squats. So this is still a pretty good day for her though. I'm not, I can't really remember what else exercises we did. We tried to hit a max effort bench press here. So she went for 115. Her previous best was 105. She didn't quite get it, but like I've said, I've said this a lot to my female clients, upper body um, strength gains are just so much slower. So she's going to keep working hard there and um, doing the best she can with her upper lifts, really. Then um, we moved on to, I guess not moved on, prior to this week, this was Monday, uh, deadlifts for her. So she had a little bit of form issues, even when she pulled 200 pounds the previous week. So we kind of made some adjustments. I, I told her to flare her feet out a little bit more. I also told her to drop her hips and try to really feel her hamstrings being tight as opposed to losing all that tightness when her hips shoot up. So I thought the form was quite a bit better today, or not today, on this day than it was in the previous week. She also is kind of doing some touch and go reps here. So she's kind of letting it bounce and kind of getting a little bit of momentum. Um, so I always tell my clients to kind of make sure it's a rest pause deadlift. But other than that, these looked a lot, a lot better than her previous week's pulls. Again, it's it's kind of a hit and miss thing because she's she can still get stronger while she's working on her form she's not so far along that she has to kind of take weight off to, to work on her form a lot of newbies or a lot of people who don't have a long training age can can do both so I wouldn't recommend if, if your form is not 100% perfect you don't always need to back off the weight you can maybe just correct something pretty acutely and make it better even with the your working weight so I think this did all, this worked a lot better and not sure if we're going to max out again in the next two weeks with that 200 pound deadlift. It's a pretty good goal. We'll probably kind of work in some threes, maybe some fives. And then right here is just kind of her um, her last heavy set of squats. This was an awesome day for her. You really see me get hyped up. She hits a 185 pound squat right here. Um, and she actually said afterwards she thought she could hit it for another breath. I'm not quite sure of that, but I'm um, really happy this 185 squat. We really have like one or two weeks together left. Um, so maybe hit like a 190 squat, 195. We're really shooting for 200, but I'm not sure. Again, um, she's not. Hopefully, she's not done training this last couple of weeks. So, uh, but yeah, we'll probably have one or two more episodes. I really got a lot of good feedback from this guy. So uh, thank you very much for that. And again, thank you for Brooke for allowing us to uh, film her and stuff. So I got some funny footage for you guys this week, uh, right here. I'll see you guys next week. Okay, you guys probably can't see this because it's dark, but I challenged Brooke to a run. So we're gonna we're gonna run, Woo! And, and I don't do cardio ever. He loves cardio. Uh, so this is gonna be interesting. We're gonna run for a little bit, and then I'll uh, have my reaction to this <laughs> run, like five minutes maybe. Okay, this is Brooke. You we can see you a little bit. So okay, um, if, I never, if you never see me again, it's because I died a, a lonely death running. Okay, so you guys. See me? We probably ran a mile, maybe. Let's give it to me, say I ran a mile in like nine minutes. And my calves are burning, and my lungs hurt, my testosterone dropped, and my estrogen increased. I lost all my muscle. No, he didn't. And in an hour and a half, I'm about to go eat a steak. <laughs> That's gonna taste so good. I broke kicked my ass. Yeah! I'm breathing. I'm pretty sure she walked the whole time, so. No. Uh, yeah, I don't run. It's a bad idea. To all you people that run, I don't know. Look why. how sweaty he is. Yeah, and it's like fucking 40 degrees. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. Looked, uh, good client, besides the fact that we can run. I didn't make you, you challenged me. We have me. our beautiful rec center here that you can see with the lovely warm weight room and cardio machines that people shouldn't use. So, checking out from Emporia, Kansas. Um, I made it alive. Talk to you guys later.